I wanted to cover a very useful feature within pivot tables and that is the ability to rank order your data. Um, so giving the greatest value, uh, the ranking of number one, the next greatest value, the ranking of two and so on down the line. And we're going to do that using this mock-up sales data from a company called Cap America Industries. And what we're going to care about is the states and the sales revenues. We want to rank the state with the most sales as number one, and then the state with the second most sales as number two, and then so on down the line. So let's go ahead and select our entire data set and go pivot table. OK. And we're going to bring in the states, and we're going to bring in their sales revenue. So obviously we could do this manually by um, sorting options descending by sales revenue and then going outside of our pivot table and just writing one, two, three and auto filling down here until we get to Connecticut. Um, but pivot table will actually allow you to do that ranking within the actual pivot table. And we're going to do that by accessing the value field settings tab which you can do either by hitting this drop down menu here or double clicking on the header that you want to change the value field setting. And we're going to go over to this tab here that says show value as and you're going to see that the default is no calculation. We're going to drag it down to rank and we want the largest value to be number one and the smallest value to be the biggest uh, ranking and so we're going to select the largest to smallest. And when we do this, we expect Ohio to be number one and Kentucky number two. When we hit OK, we see that in fact happens. Now, if we want to do the reverse of this for some reason, we want to say that the best state on this list or the number one ranking state is the one that sold the least, we can do that, as you just saw, by going into value field settings, show value as, and we want to select rank smallest to largest and now Connecticut will be number one and Ohio will be number 24. So that is how you rank your data within um, the pivot table um, and not have to do it manually and again this is very helpful very useful tool especially when you're dealing with multiple years worth of data you can actually rank order each one of those states or each one of those years um, for the highest sales in a given year. Um, and I'm sure when you play around with this, you'll uh, find a lot of great use case scenarios for it. So thanks a lot for watching. I hope this helps.